<laughs> no pressure, Ozzy. Nice. No Barcelona. <laughs> Let's play darts. Right, so here we go. The serious questions are done. Well, let's play some football slash darts, really. So, Steph, I'm going to play with you. Okay. Ailey and Fallon are going to play together. Now, <laughs> given it's Man City, I reckon we're going to go for the light blue is 20. Uh, the yellow is clearly the 50 for the ball. And then uh, navy, 10. Okay, so... <laughs> right, off you go, Fallon. <laughs> Great start. Ooh, what does that mean? Ooh. That's in between. Oh, that's oh. navy Hang blue. VAR? VAR? Navy blue. Here, go on then. Oh. VAR. Oh. <laughs> VAR. <laughs> Good start, Fallon. <laughs> God, Steph. <laughs> uh, proper light blue. No debate there. 40 points. No pressure, Ozzy. Oh! That was a good shot. That, that was. was it needs to stick though. <laughs> yeah. Final score. Hayley and Fallon, 60. The winners, Hayley we win. and Fallon. Yay. And now we've got to try and get ball now. <laughs> For a ball, guys. Oh. And we think that Manchester City this is for you as well, really. Oh, cool. You should have a dartboard in the club. Yay. Oh, yeah? thank you. Thank you. Woo. Okay, good. Right, now a bonus round. You have all got to kick the ball at me. <laughs> <laughs> Fallon, this is just from us. Oh, thank you. <laughs> a little Man City. Oh, it's even got a 180 on it. Oh, that's awesome. Thank yeah, you. No worries. Thank you. Thank you. Are you excited about the, uh, the game coming up at the Derby? Yeah, no, football has definitely, you know, grown on me. I mean, especially watching the Euros on the TV and stuff like that. I mean, the Euros were everywhere. Uh, so, yeah, since, you know, seeing everyone's reaction to the women winning as well, like, it's just like now I just want to watch more of it because it was so entertaining at the time. So I was like, yes. And obviously you've been at City here today. How, how have you found it? How have you been made welcome by the players? Has it been a good experience? Yeah, it's been a brilliant, <laughs> yeah, no, it's been a brilliant experience. You know, they're both lovely people. You know, I felt so welcome, even though I could kick a football really you know I didn't feel like they you know they just felt so welcoming and the actual uh, facility itself is just amazing I didn't expect it to be as big and you know it's so, oh, it's been an amazing day good luck with everything hi guys it's Fallon Sharon I just want to say good luck to Man City and the Derby Hi, nice to meet you. Thank you for coming. Hi, no problem. Right. So they're all very excited <laughs> in the throes of Christmas madness. So, uh, <laughs> so you hear the... No, not at all. So they'll be just like, <laughs> and they see you. So they're just practicing. Well, they're they're the very youngest ones in the practice and the nativity. <laughs> so enjoy yourself and thank you very much for taking time out to come and join us. Thank no you problem. for having us. Uh, we just come down to one of the local primary schools um, to meet with the year six class and surprise one of the girls, Hayley, and she's going to be a mascot at our Derby Day game at the Etihad next weekend. So you've got a very special surprise for you. Come on in. Yay. Say hello. Oh, she died. Oh. Hayley, can you say hello to Chloe and Sandy, please? Yeah. Hi. Hi. They've been hey. learning a lot about you this morning on the top of your should say. Guys, would anyone like to ask a question to Chloe or Sandy, maybe about something that we just spoke about, or one of your own? Put your hands up if you'd like to ask a question. You have to get nervous. Uh, it was amazing. Uh, it's what dreams are made of. Just like when you score a goal in the playground, that feeling, it never, it never leaves you. So scoring the winner at Wembley, yeah, it was absolutely amazing. And I think about it every day. Uh, Sandy, you just moved to Manchester City, haven't you, uh, just recently? What was it like moving? So a lot of these are going to be moving from primary school to high school, coming out of the comfort zone. What was that like, Sandy, moving back to Manchester City? Um, I think for me, I was pretty lucky because I'd just come from Everton, which I'd already knew, knew Chloe at. Um, so I think when you know friendly faces, that always makes it easier. I think you're always going to be a bit nervous when something's new and something's unknown. But 
Um, like for me, I was able to settle in really quickly just because the girls at Man City were really nice, which I'm sure a lot of the people at high school will be really nice here when you move up there. Now, Chloe, Sandy, have you ever met a super fan before? From what I hear, we've got one in the bathroom today. Hayley, do you want to stand up? Come here. Chloe and Sandy have got a nice little gift for you. Do you want to listen to them? Watch your culture. Here you go. So at the Derby, you're going to be the mascot. So we'd like to welcome you to the Etihad and you're going to be mascot for us. Give her a round. Are you excited? <laughs> Take you by surprise a bit. There you go. Lovely to meet you, girls. Thank you. There you go. And ahead of the derby, it's going to be a big game. How do you think Hayley will feel now that she's been invited down to be a mascot? Yeah, it'll be a brilliant day for her and hopefully we can get the win and the three points to make her day even more special. Hey everyone, I'm Karen Bardsley and we're here today at CFA and I'm going to meet with some university students from MMU and I'm going to give them some free derby tickets to the game. Hi, how's it going? Guys, we've got a special guest here. She'll show up later. <laughs> I chose MMU because at the time they offered this really specific sporting directorship class um, and they had obviously links with cities and the PFA so it just made it really easy but like everyone's super approachable with the staff like the students are all really cool and it was just easy so it made made sense. Is it Sunday? Yeah the derby yeah. There's a big difference between playing at the Etihad and then the pitch over there or yeah. the fans and stuff. Yeah just amazing to play in like a jam full stadium you know like the sounds, they, they echo onto the pitch, like the vibe, the atmosphere is just unreal. Okay, so you guys obviously know that the Derby's coming up on Sunday and, um, you know, because you guys are doing such great work, we'd like to give you guys free tickets to come to the game. How do you think the girls obviously train and now will be feeling for it ahead of Oh, they're pumped. Sunday? They're pumped, I can tell you that for sure. I think this is the one Obviously they're up for every game, but this is always like another level. Um, and for me personally, I think it's a bit strange like being slightly detached, but you know, I'll be there in the studio on Match Day Live and I think um, it's gonna be really hard not to be biased. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah, I would let you know today. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Can you just speak? Or dancing on that? No, you can't do that. Yeah, I think I'll be with that. Yeah, the shoulders, which I think is important. Is that better? Yeah. Just two. Right, thank you very much, thank guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you Morning. Morning. <laughs> Actually, is it Haley? Yeah. <laughs> Hey. Bit cold. Yeah. 
Bom bom ba. I said my type of vibe. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, Leila. Oh, this is such a white Christmas. Nice. It's nice. It's like Barcelona. It's like Barcelona. <laughs> Barcelona. Barcelona. Play, play, play. Over 43,000 tickets sold so far. It's um, a great occasion. I suppose this is something we want to see on a regular basis, but more importantly, on the pitch on Sunday, how important is the experience of your big name players, those that have done it in the Euros on the big stage, going to be? Well, yeah, I think it, you know, experience is great to have. You know, we've got uh, a lot of young players as well, so they'll draw on the experience of the elder players. But um, and I think that'll help as well, just to try and normalise things, as much as there's quite a bit of hype around this game. But we're really looking forward to the game on Sunday. Laura, if you could just step in front of the camera here, please. Good to go? Yep. Lovely. So, Laura, at the Etihad, you've obviously been here before, a few years ago, but how excited are you ahead of this weekend's clash against United? Can't wait. I think it's going to be a great day, massive crowd. Really hope that we can put on a performance and make everyone proud of us and yeah, just enjoy the occasion. It's gonna be a great day. Can you do a spin No pressure, Ozzy. Nice. Yeah. 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 Yeah.